Hello, guys. Good evening. Do you hear me? Hello, hello. Hello. Good evening. Hello, Nelson Rolando. How is it going today, Monday? How is it going? How are you? Good. Okay, that's great. Excellent, Elizabeth. Okay. Hello. Great to see you. Uh, microphone, microphone is not activated. Um, excuse me. Good there evening. There you go. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Josue Neftali, hello. Hello. Hello, teacher. How is it going? Good? Yes, I'm feeling good. You're feeling great. Perfect. Uh, thank you for your greeting. Hello, Jancy Andrea Melendez Mayen. Hello. hello. How's it going? Good? Great, great. Excellent. Great. Okay, perfect. I feel better. I feel already recovered 100%. I don't have flu anymore. No flu, no mocos. No flu anymore. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm perfect. I'm fine. Okay. More than fine. Yes. I just a small, <clears throat> a small, uh, a small flu, but no, not, it's not the big problem. It wasn't. It is not anymore. Jancy Sare Sanchez Morales. Hello. Good evening. Good evening, Alberto Valdez. Daisy Magdalena and Jamie Rosibel. Okay. Hello, guys. Good evening. Welcome, welcome. Good evening. Oscar Guardado, welcome to. And is joining to the class. Let's see who else. Sandra Vasquez. Okay. Hello. Hello, Oscar. Great to see you. Hello. Nice to meet you. Okay. Nice to meet you. No, nice hey, to meet you. Me. It's only for the first class. <laughs> okay. But no yeah, problem. It's it's okay. It's nice to see you. Yes. Nice to see you. Yes. See you. Yes. But hey, okay. meet. Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's a common mistake, but no problem. Okay. Good, guys. Um. Good, uh, good weekend. Good previous weekend. Nice weekend. Bad weekend. Working weekend. Okay. Yes, I was working on, on Saturday. Okay, work. You work on Saturday, uh huh, Josue? Uh, so, so Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> you worked. Wow. Yes, it works. Tyrant, Tyrant. Hey, Jancy, Andrea, and you? Here, volcano is activity. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Volcano is activity. Yeah. Now, so, uh, we are... Estamos un poquito preocupados. Yo vivo cerca del volcán. <laughs> oh, okay. Be pending on the news. Okay, be pending. Okay, good. But we hope not, not anything bad happens to us. Okay, good. Uh, hi guys, uh -huh. good weekend, bad weekend, nice activities, no activities. No much, work. no much, <laughs> okay. Okay, only worked. Okay, solo trabajo, only worked. Okay, yes, good. Uh, and uh, here uh, uh, in Shulton City, uh, Tenemos fiestas patronales en el Oh, Sultán. the patronal parties. Okay. okay. But if with the volcano, with the with the news and the parties. <laughs> wow, how is that? What a contrast. The contrast, contrast right? <laughs> okay, <laughs> we gotta continue. Yes. Okay, guys. So welcome. Uh, today we have a new class, new topics. We are going to continue with uh, with your learning English tonight. Okay. Just uh, let me share the monitor. Okay, uh, did you finish the models? The models, um, I mean, the assignments. Intermediate done, pre -inter the intermediate. Uh -huh. the, not yet. Uh, not yet. <laughs> the, the exam, the midterm exam, not yet. Ah, the exam, yeah. The midterm exam, yes, I mean that one. Yeah, yes. Okay, remember. Yes, you can advance in in other in other assignments okay now we are gonna cover this is the the week number three we are gonna continue studying the topics of the unit 
Number? Four. 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 Yes. These four days that we have a class, we are going to cover the unit four only. And the final one is going to be the unit number five and the final exam. Okay, good. The next. Good, good. Uh, let's see. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome. Okay, uh, class number nine. Number nine. nine. Yes, today is class number nine. Uh, yes. Let's advance a winter meeting model <laughs> one. Uh, okay, a volunteer for this. Goals are. Seating hmm? goals is the first step in turning the invis invisible into the visible. All right. And that was said by Tony Robbins. Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess it's a writer or I don't know. But I liked that setting, setting goals or preparing or write down your goals is the first step in, in turning the invisible into the visible. Okay, go for your goals. If your goal is to speak better English, go for it every day. Practice, practice. Okay, uh, the indications, we're gonna, gonna stop on that. We're gonna pass that. And we're going to continue with today's class. Okay, speaking, listening, grammar, and practice. The four skills, the four of them, and the tools. Okay, topic is going to be today. Present perfect. Present perfect. Present Yes, correct. This topic is in your, in your unit, in this unit four. We are going to check uh, the difference between the present perfect and the simple, the simple past. Okay. And the sentence, the sentence that is on screen. What the tense, the tense is the first and second, and second sentence. sentence. Okay. Maybe you have seen, okay, I am using the present perfect. Maybe you have seen this exercise in other classes or in the past. It's not difficult to notice the difference. And the sentence says, I've lost my keys. Okay, I've lost my keys. What is the tense ah. of the sentence? I have the tense is? Lost. Uh, the no, tense, okay. the complete tense. Uh, the tense. I lost my keys. Perfect. I have the present, present perfect. perfect. Okay, present. How, how do you recognize that it's present perfect? How? How do you yes. recognize that it's present perfect? Because it's using the, the how. Huh? Okay, uh, the contraction, use right? Auxiliary have uh -huh. a verb and... And what else? There, there are three things in this sentence. Three things. The first one is, yes, the auxiliary. Have. I have number two. The uh, verb is in participle. The verb that is in the participle, correct. That is number two. And number three, the key. The key number three that is present perfect. What is number three? Let's see if you guess. Complement? No. Complement is in everything. Contraction? No. No, no, not the contraction. Someone said it. A moment ago. Okay, number three. Not yet. Uh, no, uh -huh. no, no, no. Number three in um in recognition okay. of the present perfect. Uh -huh. it's in admiration. No, no, no. no. <laughs> and the admiration mark. No. Okay. Pay attention to this because this is a key for you to get more more ideas. Okay. Do you see question for you? Do you see any expression time like yesterday, a moment ago, uh, today is a week? No, 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 no. No, uh, right? Okay, no. Pres, pres, uh, in present perfect, we have no expressions time, time. like in the simple past. <gasps> that is number three. You don't see it, but it is there. No la ve, pero ahí está. Yes? Uh huh. Because expression times are only for simple past, but present perfect, no. Okay, good. And the second one is? I am lost my case, 
last night. I, I am, my... I am. The verb I to love... be. I love, I love you. you. I love my... I lost. No verb to I be. Lost. I, lost. I lost my cheese last, last night. Last night. Last night. Okay, see, this is simple past because you are using a subject, yes. the verb in simple past, lost, okay, in the expression time that is last, last night. night. This is very specific, last night, okay? That was a time where, or when, in this case, when you lost your kids. Okay, like the picture. Good. And today, today, today. Today we are going to learn about the difference between present perfect and simple past tense. And the simple past, okay, good. Um, at the beginning, it might be confusing, but you have seen this topic in the past. But we are going to review because there are specific situations in which you have to use or it's better to use present perfect and not the simple past or the opposite. Okay, let's click on the link and let's open this. Okay, uh, this is a website that you can check, but we are going to check it together. Uh, the first one says, what's the difference? What's the difference? Present perfect and past simple. Okay. And ta -ta -ta -ta, present perfect simple. Okay. We have different uh, present perfect. Past perfect, present perfect, etc. And in the present perfect, please help me from the class. Uh, Nelson, Nelson, can you help me reading this, this first part? Yes. Present perfect simple. Unfinished action that started in the past and continue to the present. Uh -huh. the example. I, I know Julie for 10 years and I still know her. Okay, and I still know her. Okay, unfinished actions that I started in the past. Okay, this is a point in the past, but in the present perfect continues. Okay, it doesn't stop. I've known, if you check, participle. The verb is in participle. Known. I've known Julie for how many years? 10 years. Ten. Ten years. Okay, but when I say this, when I say it, do I still uh, do I still know uh, Julie? And I still know her. Uh -huh. I still know her because I it can be eleven years, twelve years, etc. And the time goes goes by. Todavía va. Okay. What is the the simple past? Uh, let's see. Um, <laughs> Elizabeth Mejia. What is the difference in the with the simple past? The simple past finished actions. Mm -hmm. Example, I knew I knew Julie for 10 years, but then she moved away and we lost touch. Okay, good. I knew, see, the verb is I... in the simple past. Past simple, the verb in simple past. Present perfect, auxiliary, and the participle. And that's it. Person. That is the participle. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, if you notice, it's using 10 years in this part and 10 years in this one. The difference is that for it means a, a period of time, a specific period of time for 10 years and no more. Then she, uh -huh. she moved. Then she moved in. The friendship was done. No more. Okay. And for the present perfect, uh, another volunteer for this one. I finished. I finished. I finished action in some, someone like when uh, the person is still a live life is present. Experience. Okay, good. Thank you. Uh, a finished action in someone's life when the person is, is still alive. What is alive? Alive. Uh -huh. What's alive? Alive, alive, uh, alive, uh, not death. 
Uh -huh. Not, yeah. not there. Vivo, yes. Life experience. Okay, what is the example? My brother has been to Mexico three times. Okay, my brother has been to Mexico three mm -hmm. times. Do you see when when the per this person was in Mexico? Do you see that oh. information? No, right? No. Not important. The experience is the important yeah. part. Perfect in part. in the present perfect, yes, the experience, not the when, no el cuando. Yeah. Okay. What is the difference of, uh, with the simple past? Uh, let's see, uh, Oscar, maybe. Simple past. Remember, we are in the simple past. I finish action in someone's life when the person is dead. My great grandmother went to Mexico three times. Okay, for example, uh, my great grandmother went already in the simple past, went to Mexico three times. But even a person that is not dead can use the simple past, yes or no? Can I use the simple past? I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I am alive. Okay, I can say, ah, yesterday I went to, to the cinema. I can use it. It's not necessary that the person must be there to use the simple past. This is an example. Okay, let's see. Let's go to the next uh, <clears throat> to the next one. Uh -huh. Volunteer, any, any of you? Okay, me. Present perfect. Yes, go, go, go ahead. Yes. yes. A finished action with a result in the present. I've lost my skills. The result is that I can't get in get into my house now. Okay, we have a, an action and we see a reaction in the present perfect. A finished action with yes. a result in the present. Okay, I've lost my keys. What yeah. happens when you lose when you lose when you lose your keys? What happens? Yeah, it's, it's terrible. terrible. Yeah. Uh huh. It's my experience for for today. Ah, really? You lost them? Yeah. I lost my my car key. Did you find them? No, I didn't. You didn't. And what did you do when you yes. realized I, that? I, I had a, I had a copy. I have a ah, copy. Fortunately. Yeah. But okay. I have to find that. Ah, okay. What was your result in your case? You had to look for your copy of the key because yeah. you lost the original. Okay. Be careful with the car keys. Yes. Those are expensive to get the copy. Yes. Okay, good. And that is the result. Okay. We have an example there in in your classmates situation. Okay, what happens in the simple past? He finished action with no result in the present. No result in the present, no connection with the present. Simple yeah. past, simple past. I lost- I lost my kids yesterday. Okay. It was terrible. Terrible. Now, now there is no result. I got new kids yesterday. Okay, uh, a solution. Let's say a solution. But if you see, yeah. there is difference in yeah. between the present perfect and the simple past. Let's see. And the final one, the final one, present perfect. Any? Any? With an um, unfinished time work this week, this month, today. I've seen John this week. Okay, you can use a similar similar time expressions in the present perfect. For example, these ones. This week is it specific. This week for you is it too, yes. is it specific? But the which day when I say this uh, week? Yeah. It can be Monday. It can be Friday. It can be Saturday. It can be Thursday. You don't know when you when you say this week. It this can way. be any day. It's not a specific, but you can use it with the present perfect. This month? It's this month. Okay. What, what about if I say, this I month. I got a, I've, uh, mm, I've found the receipt of my credit card bill for this month. When do I pay my, my bill? 
When do I pay? Do you know when? The day? No. No, right? Okay, I can use it. I found the receipt of my credit card bill that I got to pay this month. I am using this month, but I, I am not being specific. It can be on the 15th or it can be on the 30th at the end of the month. And today? Specific? Today. But day specific day. can yes. be um, depends can be a specific but let's check yeah, well. <laughs> the time maybe for the time <laughs> talking oh, about oh, the time yeah. is not a specific not a specific, not a specific. Not a specific. Not a specific. today today the day during the day but at what time no specific uh-huh yeah. and the example is I've seen this. Ah, that's that's great that you saw him. Okay, I am using the simple past. Ah, that's great that you have seen him. I can use the present perfect or the simple past. Depends on what do you want to say. Press simple past with with a finish. With a finish. word. Last week, last week, last week, last month, last week, yesterday. Yes. Okay. Last week. Okay. Last week. Uh -huh. I saw John. Last week. Last week. When? When was uh, last week? Last week was uh, from this Monday. From Monday twenty twenty first. Uh huh. Yeah. To to Sunday twenty seventh. Okay. That means last week. Okay. That means yeah. that you are going to check. Uh, maybe the day, if you remember the day that you saw John, it, it yeah. could be on any of these days, but during the last week. Yes? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Is it clear last month? Last month? Last when month? was last month? Last month it was October. Yeah. October. Uh, yeah, because we are in November. That's yeah. right. Yes. Uh, oh, connection issues. I'm really sorry, Tanya, but okay, no problem. I hope you can recover the signal. And yesterday, a specific yes, or no okay. specific? Yes, but yes, we don't specific. know the time. Uh, right. If you want to be extremely specific, no time. We don't have time. But yesterday is yesterday. Yes. Yesterday was what day? Yesterday it was. was Today. Sunday. Mm, Sunday. Sunday. Uh -huh. Sunday. Yeah. But Sunday, correct. Because we are on Monday. Yeah. Okay, good. And those are the main differences between uh, the simple past and the present perfect. Okay, let's see. Mm, we have some things that you can read. You can check this later. And we have exercises to do. Let's try this one. Let's try one. Present perfect or past simple exercise one. You're going to find in this website um, these type of exercises. Let's try together. Let's see. Uh, number one. Last night. Mm -hmm. Okay. I've, I lost my kids. I've, I've lost my I've okay. I've lost. I've lost. I've lost my keys. My keys. Uh -huh. And the rest. I have. I have my. my What's the meaning my of flight? What's the meaning of flatmate? Flatmate. I had to call my flatmate to let me in. Ah, it's like um, uh, someone who shares the room with you. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yes. Okay. It's like roommate, no. Uh -huh. Be similar, roommate. roommate. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes you're going to see words that you haven't. Okay. I am using the present perfect in negative. Sometimes you're going to see words that you have not seen because of the websites. Some websites are from, are from, from England because of that. Okay. Uh, correct or incorrect? This sentence. Correct. 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 Mm -hmm. I get that. So I get yeah. that with that. Um, do you okay hmm. present past simple because we have a solution? Uh -huh. Ya pasó. 
Oh, uh, okay, okay. Yes. That's one point. Yes, uh, we have a result, etc. But more than the result, let's check if the sentence has uh, a time expression. Last night, last yesterday, night. last yes. month, last it's year, not... in 2005. Uh -huh. Did you know That's when in the simple period, in the simple past? Um, okay, I'm going to leave it. I lost. Is lost. Yes, only. Okay. No either, right? No. Ah, uh, because we have a time expression. Time expressions <laughs> are for the simple past only. No present perfect. That's one point. Okay, but in order for you to see that the sentence is correct or mm -hmm. incorrect, I'm going to leave it like I... that. Okay, I'm going to leave it like that. Don't worry. At the end, we are going to check. Two, I. I've lost, I've, I've mm -hmm. lost my keys. I've lost my keys. Can you? Can you help me look, look for them? them? Okay. I don't see any time expression in the sentence. So uh, it means that I can use the present perfect. But we are gonna we're going to check. Three, three, number three. Mm -hmm. I have visited Paris three times. Okay, I have visited, visited. visited Paris, Paris. Paris three times. Oh, lucky Paris, nice. Okay, my sister, my sister has visited Paris once. My sister. On September. Yeah. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Okay. Uh, correct in your opinion or incorrect? Yeah, yes, correct. Yes, correct. Okay. What? What it matters in the sentence? What it matters? The the time? Do you see any time or time expression mm -hmm. or the the experience? The experience. experience. Oh, we have the experience. Yeah. This one. We have the experience. Yeah. That means not the time. Uh, yeah, no time, no when, no month, no yeah. day, no nothing. Yeah. Uh, yes. Four. Last, Last year, year, I visited Paris. This is Last simple year, I Okay, correct, Last yes. Year, Last year. See, Last time year. expression, correct. Time expression for the simple past. I visited Paris. Mm -hmm. Five. Okay. I, I have a new. I have new. I have no. I have no, new. No, okay. I, no. Ah, there I is know. a mistake. No. I know. I know. Okay. I have, Let's see. Do you do you remember the participles of the verb? Hmm? So irregular. So. so so. Okay, that's why you need to review irregular I know. verb. List. Okay, we are gonna check. Uh huh. There is one list. Okay, for the present perfect, we use the participle, and the participle is the third form. Mm -hmm. See the third one. Um, that depends if you have a regular mm -hmm. or irregular verbs mm -hmm. in the sentence. The verb is no, 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 no. new. <laughs> No, new no, letter no. E. No. Okay. No. New, new is no. this one. New. New. That is simple. Past. Yeah. Uh -huh. But it's no. Okay. Let's find it. Uh, just in one moment. I'm going to type it. Okay. No. 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 New. No. no. In the participle. No. 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 Known. no. Uh, okay. I have known. No. My great grandmother for a few years. She died when I was eight. Oh, but here is in the simple past. She died in simple past. She died, uh -huh. When I was eight, when simple was past. Eight. Yes. So, uh -huh. mm. do I change? Do I, I change knew it? my great grandmother. 
Yes, I knew. See. I knew. Uh -huh. I knew my great grandmother. Okay. Yes. Okay. When I click on okay. when I click on finish, I... we are gonna check. Uh, okay. Okay, we are gonna check. There are twenty, Let but me... we are not gonna do all of them. Don't worry. Okay. But if you check, you get a scan the whole sentence so you can see present past present perfect or simple past i don't see anything about past past present perfect but simple past yes she died and i was eight okay but we can check at the end six i no julie for i have uh -huh. I, have, I have I have known no Yuli for three years. So for three years. We still meet. We, we still, still meet once once Ah, okay, okay. This part, this part in the sentence tells you. Ah, that means that you you still meet your friend, Julie. Okay. Do you you still get together? Okay. Every Sunday, every Saturday, I don't know. Yes, this means that is uh, present perfect, correct. I'm not sure about the contractions, but I'm going to leave them like that. Uh, this one, number seven, what do you think? Number seven. I I have played or I played hockey since I was a child. I have played. I'm pretty good. Cool. I, I have played. I, I, I played. The okay. Hockey since I was a child. Pretty good. I am pretty good. I have played. I have. I have played. Yes, I have. I have. Okay, like that? I, I have played. played. Okay, when you see the word since, the word since, yes, it can be used in the present perfect. Yes. Mm. Since I was a child. So you continue playing soccer, okay? Mm -hmm. You continue. Maybe you are 30 and you continue playing, etc. Yes, when you have the word since, that means that it can be present perfect. Eight. She played hockey at the school, but she didn't like it. Ah, okay. Why do you say that in simple past in the verb? Uh, and when she were at the school, she was asleep. When she school. was, she was. She, she was. were, no, she, she was. was. Okay. She, uh, she played uh, hockey mm -hmm. at the school, but she didn't. Didn't, like didn't like easy <laughs> for the simple like past. Okay. This is the main reason why mm -hmm. it's simple past, because the auxiliary is didn't in negative. Correct. Okay, and we continue. We can continue doing exercises, but we are going to skip them. Let's see. Show, show, or check. I know it says show and check. Okay, let's see the first one. Uh, check. <laughs> check. Maybe uh, the contraction. Maybe, maybe the contraction. Maybe the contraction is incorrect. Yeah. Oops. Let me correct <laughs> it. Oh my. Last night. Ah, but you said seem present well, perfect. It in wasn't. Ah, it is uh, see. simple past. I told you I'm gonna leave mm -hmm. it like that. We can check later. So it's simple past. No, uh no. this one. Yes, ah, correct. Yes, present perfect. Mm -hmm. This one. Hey, I didn't play the music. I like the the background music. I didn't pour it. It's kind of boring with music, right? I like listening to music. Okay, I got the audio. Just a moment. I'm going to play it. I like the background music. Okay, let, let me check the volume. It's too high. <clears throat> I need it in one. Okay, number one. Okay, number three. And this one. Check. Correct. Correct, correct, and correct, correct. Okay, pretty good, guys. Okay, good. All right. 
um, in this part during the in the website you can see more links okay you can see more links at the end uh hey where was it okay i was in this part okay but uh we have a practice about the present perfect and this class is gonna be divided in two in two parts the first one is for the present perfect practice and tomorrow is gonna be for the simple past okay uh, just let me open the link uh, but for this exercise i won't need the background music okay what is the indication the indication is that we need to complete the story using the correct participle of the verb according with the story about the the what is the activity paper the yeah, paper man have you seen paper. listen listen have you seen this uh, story this cartoon no no yes never yes, I, do. I don't know ah because you no. were with my in my class in in another course but for yes. the ones that have not this is something that you can practice with and um, to study some topics in this case the present perfect okay we have uh 15 15 segments or 15 scenes and we need to use the present perfect tense okay uh your attention please Okay, the sentence that is on the screen. Woman. Woman. Catch. 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 Simple catch. past or present perfect? Simple past. Simple past. Uh, okay, oh. let's see. No. Okay, remember. <laughs> The topic is present <laughs> perfect. You need to remember ah, the auxiliary Experience. according with the subject. Okay, the auxiliary according with the subject and the participle of the verb in parentheses. Okay, if we have woman, what is the auxiliary in the present perfect for has, 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 has. and the participle? Coat. Coat. Okay, what is coat? What is cat? Cat. Ah, in the participle. Coat. Paper. Paper. Okay, let's see uh, the second, the second scene. Mm -hmm. Is with the present perfect, you say? Uh -huh, correct, yes. They have seen each other. They have, and the participle of see is? Seen. 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 Okay, sean? Each other. Sean? What is? Visto, yes. They have seen each other. Good. And that is correct. Good. Let's see the next one. Okay, tell woman, me. Woman has kissed people. Woman has kiss. Okay, kiss. kiss like that. Kiss. 
Bien, de participle, de participle of keys. Regular. About the pronunciation, yeah. In the grammar, you see the. And Kisa. what about the pronunciation is? Kissed. And no, it's not kissed. 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 T. T at the end. Letter T. Kissed. The paper. Correct. Okay. Remember, ah, we are going to practice pronunciation of the regular verbs too. Uh -huh. No problem. Let's see the next one. Okay, next scene, next scene. What happens? Then hasn't caught the train. Hasn't no. like that. That's caught. 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 Repeat. Caught. Caught. Caught the train. Coach. Mm, no, he's caught. Caught. Cut. Like like K O T cut like that. Cut. Okay, let's see. Ah, correct. Okay, negative. See, man hasn't got the train. Ah, uh, next next scene. Next, next. Woman has came. Or has came. 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 Okay, let's remember the participle. Uh, come, simple present, come. Simple past. Came. 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 And the participle. Came with the... Uh, no, it's the no. first come, in, come. like come. in the present. Yes, the first one. <laughs> has come to the... The employer. With the employer. The... Yes, D, because the next word is vowel at uh, the beginning. The, oh. the employer. Okay, good. Next. Man has made. May has. Made. Make it. Make it. Make it. Purple We correct. No. Make. Make. Man has. Okay. Let's remember. Okay. That's why it's important to review the the make. three forms. Make present. Make. Past is. Made. 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 And. The participle made. 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 But is it correct? Yes, yes. it's incorrect. It's M A D E. Ah, okay. Yeah. As I have it, is is incorrect. Is M A D D D Made. Made. Okay, let's see. Made. Ah, correct. This is the correct way <clears throat> of the participle. Yes. Okay, good, good, good. No van a regañar, Yeah, maybe. Paper plane. Paper plane. Paper plane. Paper plane. Hasn't got, got, got in to the woman. Hasn't got in. Got in. Got in. Got in. One, one T or double T? Double, double T. Double T. Okay, let's see. Le hasn't gotten in a feeling. 
Women. Women. Women or woman? No, woman. 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 Only woman. Singular. Yes. Singular. Oh. Has, okay. The thing is, that is gotten is in American English and God is in British English. Yes. That is the difference. Yeah. Okay. But no problem with that. You got the idea. Uh, next. Okay. Has made a lot of paper. Plate. Has made a, a lot of paper. paper plate. Okay. Has made. Has made. made. Uh, how many? How many paper planes? A lot. A lot of. Okay. okay. Is that a specific or undefined? Undefined. Not defined, right? No, undefined. we don't know if they were fifteen or fifty. Yeah. That is the difference. Yes. Okay. Good. Uh, okay, enter in is correct. Next. Man has lost lost paper plane. Okay, lost lost the paper plane. Okay, correct. Next scene. <clears throat> Run, has run, run, run out of the office. Out of the office. Ran. Like that? Yes? Okay, I will hit enter. Oh, no. Run. Run in the present is the same as in the participle, yes. Run is the simple past, but now you know. Okay. Mm -hmm. Next, uh, next scene. Man has sent mm -hmm. seen has woman. Hasn't seen. No. Mm -hmm. Man hasn't seen. Has seen. 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 The woman. Let's see. Yeah, yes. correct, correct. It was that one. Next.
paper, planes, paper, start to move. Okay. Paper planes it has started to move. It's a plural. Ah, yes, right. Because it has is for in it. And we don't have the singular. This is not singular, this is plural. Plural it yes. be has. It must be have. 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 Okay. Have. Now it's correct this part, but what about this part? The verb. How do you pronounce it? Start the starting participle. Start. Start. What is the participle of a start? Start. Started. 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 It did. O sea, is it did in grammar, in pronunciation, is I did. Started. 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 To, to move. To move. Okay, let's see. Ah, correct, correct. But you say the has. Has, no, has is more singular. How? Okay. Uh -huh. You got to check first and the, what it, the subject is. Uh, next. Woman has taken. 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 Okay. Yeah. Taken is a participle. Take is a present. The past is took. Took. Take. And participle. Taken. 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 Correct, correct, correct. Let's see. Next. Man, man has has ten has ten has ten okay stand it. Uh, what up. is the participle of stand stand it up stand it like stand it. This. yeah stand it stand it stood it stood. Mm. It stood. It stood is the past. Is the participle mm. or the simple past. Ah, okay, let's see. Yes, mm. this is the participle. It stands, mm. it stood, it stood. That is a participle. Yes. Okay. Next, next. Now, the present perfect. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, I'm really sorry. The thing is, hello, teacher. hello, hello. I'm back. Teacher. The thing is that my computer, my computer doesn't show when I have low battery and it went off suddenly. 
and I have the problem, problem teacher. With, no problem with the computer, but sorry. Okay, but I'm problem. back. Okay, the, it didn't take me more than one minute or less than a minute to come back. Okay, uh, we're gonna check the final part of the story. Just let yeah. me make it bigger. Okay, uh, this one is they, they have, have they have. have they have at the end. In the end. Meeting. Met. They have meeting. Met. meeting. Met. No. Met. 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 Yep. Yes. Okay. Um, the simple past? No. Meet. Met. No. Okay. Let's check. Let's find it. Meet. Meet. Simple present. Simple past, met, met, met participle, met, met, met. Uh, met. Yes. Met, met, the met. same. Okay, let's see. Ah, correct. Uh -huh. Let's see if we have another scene. Kiss, kiss. No, it, <laughs> it wasn't kiss. Okay, no kiss. 80% kiss. Okay, 80%, no, the score, <laughs> the score is the thing. Okay, good. Uh, good guys, not bad, not bad. And remember, uh, you can investigate or in review the participle for the simple present, and we use this tense for the participle for more tenses, not only for the participle. Okay, what is next after the practice? Let's see what else. Oh, to do. To do at home. And home as home. a practice, yes. Uh, at the end, you have these links. You can use them to practice before your assignments. Before doing your assignments, you can practice with the links. You can find uh, exercises about the topic that we study during the class. Uh, let's open one, <laughs> the second one. I'm gonna open this one. Okay, this is another website that you will find exercises about grammar. Uh, let's do a couple. Karen, how about you can read read the instruction first. Put? Okay. Putting the verbs in brackets. Putting the verbs in brackets. Use present, Use present perfect. Present perfect. Example, you have this. I, my father's car, my father's okay. car. The parentheses, the verb in parentheses, wash, wash, wash to wash, wash the infinity, to wash. but I need the? The person. The person. I, have, I have a question. I have a question. Wash it. Wash it. Wash it. Wash it. Wash Wash it. Wash Wash it. 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 Karen. 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 Has. 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 Me. An email. An email. Email. An email. Email. No, it's email. An email. Email. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. Just this one because of the time. Dave. Dave and Pat had, 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 you can okay. click on check and you will see. Okay, correct and correct. There are only two, but the rest of them you can practice with the links. All right. Okay. All right. Uh, guys, uh, thank you for joining to the class. And we're going to continue tomorrow with the next part that is the simple pass. We're going to practice with that. Okay. See thank you. And have a great night. Have a wonderful rest. Until tomorrow. Take care. Okay. Take care. Thank you. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Until tomorrow, guys. Have a nice sleep. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye.
Bye bye. Bye bye. Take care. Take care. Bye bye. Bye bye.